Imagine stumbling upon an ancient city, lost in time, nestled high up in the Andean mountains. What secrets could it hold? In the heart of Peru, shrouded in mist and mystery, lies the enigma of Machu Picchu. This ancient Incan city, perched precariously on a mountain ridge, silently whispers tales of a civilization long past. Its grand architecture, intricately carved from the unforgiving mountain stone, speaks volumes of the Inca's mastery over their environment. But why was such a city abandoned, left to the mercy of the elements and time? And how did it remain undiscovered by the outside world for centuries, until that fateful day in the early 20th century, when Hiram Bingham stumbled upon it? Each stone, each terrace, each silent sentinel of a bygone era holds a piece of the puzzle, waiting to be unraveled. The city's haunting beauty and mystery beckon us to explore, to understand, to remember. This is the tale of Machu Picchu, the lost Incan city. Rewind to the year 1911, when the world first heard of Machu Picchu. Amid the dense Peruvian jungle and shrouded by clouds, a forgotten city lay in wait, its secrets kept for centuries, ready to be revealed by an adventurous soul. Enter Hiram Bingham III, a Yale lecturer with a passion for exploration and a hunger for historical discovery. He was not the first to set foot in Machu Picchu, but he was the man who brought this lost city to the world's attention. Bingham, backed by the National Geographic Society, embarked on an expedition that would change our understanding of the Incan civilization forever. Upon his initial exploration, Bingham found an overgrown city, its stone structures hidden beneath thick vegetation. His team began the arduous work of clearing the site, uncovering terraces, temples and houses, all intricately built with beautifully carved stones. Astonishingly, the city appeared to have been abandoned abruptly, as if the inhabitants had left in a hurry. News of Bingham's discovery quickly spread across the globe. The world was captivated by the mystery of this forgotten city. Who were its inhabitants? Why was it abandoned? How was it built in such a remote and unforgiving landscape? The questions were endless, and the answers seemed as elusive as the city itself. Bingham believed he had discovered the lost city of the Incas, a place of legend where the Incan civilization had sought refuge from Spanish invaders. His theory was widely accepted at the time, adding to the allure and intrigue of Machu Picchu. Yet, as we now know, Bingham's initial assessment was not entirely accurate. While his discovery was indeed monumental, his understanding of the city and its purpose was somewhat flawed. The city he had uncovered was not, in fact, the last refuge of the Incas, but something altogether different. Little did Bingham know, the true secrets of Machu Picchu were yet to be unveiled. Unraveling the secrets of Machu Picchu is like solving a complex archaeological puzzle. Imagine a jigsaw puzzle, with each piece representing a fragment of the Incan civilization's history, culture, and architectural prowess. We have before us the task of piecing together this intricate puzzle to form a complete picture of the enigmatic city of Machu Picchu. Let's begin by considering the various theories and interpretations about this lost city. Some historians argue that Machu Picchu was a royal estate, a retreat for Incan rulers. Others propose it was a religious site, a sacred sanctuary where high priests conducted important rituals. Yet another theory suggests it was a strategic military outpost guarding the Incan Empire against potential threats. Now, let's turn our attention to the Incan culture itself. The Incas were an advanced civilization with a sophisticated understanding of agriculture, astronomy, and engineering. Their architectural prowess is evident in the meticulously constructed stone structures of Machu Picchu. These buildings, carved from the surrounding granite, were built to withstand earthquakes, a testament to the Incans' ingenuity and technical skills. However, the question that continues to baffle archaeologists and historians alike is why the Incas abandoned this city. Was it due to the Spanish conquest, or was it a result of their own internal conflicts? Or perhaps it was due to a catastrophic event, such as an earthquake or a pandemic, that forced the Incas to flee their beloved city. Each theory, each piece of the puzzle, adds another layer to the mystery. We're left with more questions than answers, a testament to the complexity and enigma of Machu Picchu. Our understanding of this city, and the civilization that built it, is continually evolving as new discoveries and research shed light on its history. The mystery deepens as we delve into the enigma that is Machu Picchu 
As time passed, the veil of mystery began to lift from Machu Picchu. Modern technology and ongoing research have brought us closer to understanding this enigma nestled in the Peruvian Andes, and with each revelation, the city whispers its secrets to us. The latest research has allowed us to debunk some long-held theories. Once believed to be a forgotten Incan fortress, we now know that Machu Picchu was not built for military purposes. The city lacks the defensive structures typical of Incan fortresses. Instead, the architectural design suggests a place of spiritual importance, a sacred sanctuary. What's more, the theory that Machu Picchu was the lost city of the Incas, a hidden refuge during the Spanish conquest, has also been discredited. Carbon dating of artifacts unearthed at the site revealed that the city was abandoned around the year 1530, a good decade before the Spaniards set foot in Incan territory. So, if not a fortress or a refuge, what was the purpose of this city? The current understanding leans towards Machu Picchu being a royal retreat, a place for the Incan elite to commune with the gods. The presence of numerous temples and ritualistic structures supports this theory. One intriguing find is the Intihuatana, a carefully carved rock believed to have been an astronomical clock or calendar. It is positioned to point directly at the sun during the winter solstice, the most important date in the Incan calendar. This suggests that the city had a significant role in astronomical observations and rituals. Another compelling clue is the city's location. Machu Picchu is nestled between two mountains, Machu Picchu and Huayna Picchu both considered sacred in Incan mythology. This positions the city as a spiritual gateway, a bridge between the earthly realm and the divine. As we piece together the puzzle, a picture of Machu Picchu's past begins to emerge. The city, once shrouded in mystery, is starting to reveal its purpose. A sacred retreat, a celestial observatory, a bridge to the divine. Machu Picchu was perhaps all of these and more, a testament to the grandeur and complexity of the Incan civilization. From an enigmatic ruin to a world-renowned archaeological site, Machu Picchu stands as a testament to the Incan civilization. In the heart of the Andes, nestled between the lush mountains, the lost city of the Incas remains a beacon of ancient wisdom and architectural grandeur. Today, Machu Picchu is recognized by the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization, or UNESCO, as a World Heritage Site, a title that acknowledges its outstanding universal value to humanity. But what does being a World Heritage Site mean? It's not just an honorary title. It's an international commitment to preserve and protect the site for future generations. And this is a commitment that is taken very seriously when it comes to Machu Picchu. As a UNESCO World Heritage Site, Machu Picchu is not only a destination for adventurers and history buffs. It's a living, breathing testament to the ingenuity of the Incan civilization. The terraced fields, the intricately carved stones, the astronomical alignments. All these serve as a reminder of a civilization that was deeply connected with nature and the cosmos. Each year, hundreds of thousands of visitors from all corners of the globe flock to this ancient site, drawn by its mystical allure. They traverse the same paths the Incas once walked, marvel at the same vistas that left the ancient civilization in awe and leave with a deeper appreciation of the human spirit's resilience and creativity. But with this surge in tourism comes the challenge of preservation. Efforts are continually being made to ensure that the footprints of the modern world do not overshadow the imprints of the past. Strict visitor regulations, ongoing archaeological research, and sustainable tourism initiatives all play a part in the delicate dance of sharing Machu Picchu's wonders while safeguarding its integrity. Machu Picchu, a city lost and found, continues to mesmerize us with its enduring mystery. As we look towards the future, we remain committed to preserving this timeless testament to human achievement and the enigmatic charm of the Incan civilization. As we embark on this historical journey, we are left with more questions than answers. We've ventured through the mysterious Incan city, retraced the steps of those who discovered it, and delved deep into the archaeological puzzle that is Machu Picchu. We've stood at the precipice of this enigma, peering into the mists of the past, seeking to unveil the secrets shrouded within its stone walls. Yet despite our best efforts, the city refuses to relinquish all its mysteries. The purpose of its construction, the lives of its inhabitants, 
and the reason for its abandonment still elude us. This ancient masterpiece is not just a testament to the genius of Incan architecture, but also a constant reminder of our thirst for understanding. The unanswered questions beckon us, inviting us to ponder, to speculate, and to immerse ourselves in the enigmatic narrative of Machu Picchu. As the sun sets on the towering Andean peaks, the enigma of Machu Picchu continues to captivate the world.